Due to long-term sanctions from Western countries, China has faced major challenges in aviation technology. However, in December 2020, China made a groundbreaking announcement that stunned the world. The country revealed that it was developing a new aero engine capable of flying at an incredible speed of Mach 16, meaning it could circle the Earth in just two hours. To put this into perspective, the fastest aircraft today can only reach Mach 9.8. This remarkable breakthrough not only challenged the United States' dominance in this field, but also sparked widespread discussions globally. Experts believe this Chinese supersonic engine could revolutionize aviation technology. Today, we will explore what makes this engine unique and its potential impact on the future of global aviation. If you enjoy our content, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay updated with our latest videos. Now, let's dive into today's topic. In the late 1850s, China set its sights on rapidly advancing its aviation sector. This strategic move was seen as a major milestone in the country's modernization and technological growth. However, this progress raised concerns among Western nations. In response, they imposed a series of sanctions to hinder China's advancements. The United States in particular placed multiple Chinese aviation firms on a military blacklist, restricting their access to crucial aviation technologies from the U.S. and its allies. These restricted technologies included high-end sensors, lasers, avionics, and precision navigation systems, key components of modern aerospace engineering. Additionally, the U.S., along with Japan and South Korea, enforced strict export controls, especially targeting advanced chips and microelectronics crucial for aviation. Despite these harsh sanctions, China remained undeterred and doubled down on independent innovation. In 1983, the country successfully developed the Turbojet 14 engine, which powered the J8H-F-G fighter jets. Though its technical foundation was relatively weak at the time, this marked China's entry into the aviation engine sector. Over the years, China accumulated knowledge and experience in aircraft engine design and manufacturing. By the early 21st century, China had developed the Turbofan 15 engine, which incorporated advanced high-temperature alloy materials and significantly improved combustion efficiency and thrust. This engine provided stronger power for China's J-20 stealth fighter. However, China's latest hypersonic engine development has raised global concerns, as aircraft equipped with this engine could reach any location worldwide within just two hours of takeoff. But what exactly is this engine, and why is it so fast? For decades, the United States has led aerospace engine technology, particularly in hypersonic engine research. In July 2020, the American company Boom Supersonic announced the successful development of its supersonic demonstration aircraft, the XB-1, with plans for test flights in 2021. This aircraft is powered by the General Electric J-8515 engine, capable of producing 12,000 pounds of thrust and reaching speeds of Mach 2.2. At this speed, the XB-1 could complete a transatlantic flight from New York to London in just 3 hours and 15 minutes. However, in December 2020, China officially announced that it was working on an oblique detonation ramjet engine. Detonation refers to an advanced combustion process that releases over 70% of energy in a very short time and within a small space. This method more than doubles the thermal efficiency compared to traditional isobaric combustion significantly boosting engine performance. Experts consider this new engine concept to surpass all existing related technologies. Currently, NASA's X-15 wind tunnel, built in the 1960s, remains the world's largest ultra-high-speed wind tunnel, simulating conditions up to Mach 15. However, even this facility cannot meet the testing requirements for oblique detonation ramjet engines. To tackle this challenge, China has constructed the JF-22 ultra-high-speed wind tunnel, the world's most advanced facility of its kind. The JF-22 can simulate flight conditions at speeds of up to Mach 30, providing an ideal testing environment for the next generation of hypersonic engines. Recent experimental tests in the JF-22 Ultra High Speed Wind Tunnel have confirmed the incredible performance of China's oblique detonation ramjet engine. This advanced engine has demonstrated the capability to reach speeds of up to Mach 16. At this velocity, an aircraft could theoretically travel to any location on Earth within two hours. In contrast, the J-8515 engine introduced by the United States in the same year, despite being a breakthrough in supersonic technology, has a top speed of only Mach 2.2. This means that China's oblique detonation ramjet engine is nearly seven times faster, 
and its regular flight speed easily exceeds Mach 5. Such an achievement presents a major challenge to the U.S. aviation technology sector. Aircraft engines have historically been a weak point in China's aviation industry. Whether in the development of military jets or commercial passenger planes, progress in this critical technology has faced ongoing hurdles. To overcome these obstacles, China initiated an oblique detonation ramjet development program led by a prominent laboratory within the Chinese Academy of Sciences. According to available information, this new Chinese engine no longer disperses fuel within the intake duct. Instead, it pre-sprays fuel onto the engine and utilizes shock waves to introduce flammable gases into the combustion chamber for ignition. This fuel supply innovation effectively addresses issues such as excessive fuel consumption and engine instability, enhancing both operational efficiency and reliability. Additionally, the engine optimizes the shockwave detonation system, improving detonation efficiency while boosting power and thrust. The high efficiency of this shockwave detonation system enables the engine to sustain supersonic speeds under ultra-high-speed flight conditions, significantly enhancing the aircraft's strategic and tactical capabilities. Furthermore, the engine employs an oblique explosion combustion method, ensuring more complete fuel combustion and improving overall efficiency. Compared to the traditional vertical injection combustion approach, the oblique explosion method generates higher combustion temperatures and greater thrust, leading to faster speeds and extended flight distances. By advancing these key technological areas, China's new engine has made remarkable strides in the supersonic aviation sector. Not only does it surpass conventional scramjet engines in speed, but it also opens up broader possibilities for aircraft applications. At present, Western experts widely acknowledge the oblique detonation ramjet engine as a groundbreaking technological milestone. Some have even compared its significance to the invention of the jet engine itself, calling it a pivotal moment in human technological history. This statement is not an exaggeration. Back in 2004, when the US X-43A aircraft achieved Mach 7 speeds, its engine entered an abnormal operating state which lasted only 11 seconds. Similarly, in 2013, the US X-51A aircraft accelerated from Mach 4.8 to 5.1, but despite achieving a six-minute flight duration, it highlighted America's technical limitations in maintaining sustained high-speed flight. By contrast, China's new engine not only surpasses the United States in overcoming technical barriers, but also ensures stable, high-performance operation over prolonged periods. However, it is important to recognize that developing a scramjet engine is an extraordinarily complex engineering feat. This technology dates back to the Cold War, when both the United States and Russia made significant strides through decades of research and development. China, on the other hand, only began actively investing in this field around 2015. Despite this late start, the rapid progress and successful outcomes demonstrate China's exceptional capabilities and innovative strength in aviation technology. In just a few years, Chinese research teams have managed to overcome numerous technological obstacles. Although China's scramjet engine has not yet been deployed for official use, continuous advancements in technology and improvements in experimental infrastructure suggest that the development process will accelerate. As these innovations mature and become widely applied, China is poised to secure a leading role in global aviation. This forward-looking progress will not only drive China's aerospace industry to new heights, but will also enhance the world's recognition of China's capabilities in aviation technology. To stay updated on future developments and exciting news, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. We will continue to bring you more engaging and insightful content.